Yep, this looks like a king's castle, all right. Watch out for hostile enemies, 2B. Roger that, 9-Z. Huh? Wait, what did you just say? Roger that, 9-S. Wait, no, that's not what you said. You said 9s. Or at least something close to. Cut the chatter and engage the enemy. Ah. Doesn't look like I'll need this. Analysis. This part belongs to a machine life form. Doesn't look like I'll need this.
His Majesty hasn't grown at all. No, not in the slightest. How can we make him bigger? I don't know. We're too dumb to figure that out.
Is this their king? Tupi, that's an android. A Yorha type android. Alert. This unit is currently wanted by Yorha. Annihilation recommended. Annihilation? But why? Let's go, Nines. To be? <laughs> Bunker to 2B and 9S. We've picked up a signal from the black box of a fugitive known as A2. What you see in front of you is your enemy. <laughs> But she's... She deserted us. She's destroyed multiple pursuit androids. Now kill her before she kills you. Why did you betray us? Command is the one that betrayed you. Let's go after her, 2B. <laughs> Damn! She got away. Operator, this is 9S. Patch me through to the commander. Roger that, 9S. I'm sorry, commander. We failed to defeat the fugitive. I see. Well, at least you're both safe. That's an incredibly powerful unit you just faced. You should probably keep your distance in the future. Commander, why did A2 desert the force? I'm afraid that's classified. Oh? Huh. To be? Yeah? Let's go ask Pascal about A2. He might know something. All right. Whether in wind or rain, thunder or snow, or even amidst the rising flames of war, they were always together. They never understood why. And yet they spent their lives nestled together. Forever. Forever and ever. Um, Pascal? This is 9S. Oh, you survived. How wonderful. Yeah, we're fine. But there's something we want to ask you about. Anything. Actually, it needs to be in person. Hmm. Understood. I'll open the gate we built to deter enemy invaders. You'll be able to reach the village through there.
wish to speak with me personally. Whatever is the matter? It'll be faster if you just take a look at this recording. I see. Information about this A2 android is indeed contained within our archives. We all understand her to be rather dangerous. However, she's never visited our village in person. My apologies. That's all the information I have. I see. All right, thanks. Let's stay sharp and head back to the resistance camp. We should run a check on our consciousness data and resupply. Ines, why did you ask Pascal about A2? Huh? It's not recommended to interface with machines without consulting command. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Though I suppose such intense curiosity can be admirable, in its own way. <laughs> Thanks, 2B. Still, machines are the enemy. Don't forget it. Places look familiar. One looks like the amusement park, one looks like the desert, and one looks like the forest. Let's keep our eyes open next time we're in any of those areas. To be, your timing is impeccable. Our android forces currently have a carrier deployed in the Pacific Ocean. It should be back here to resupply before too long. The Resistance is assisting with the mission, so I'd like to ask you to run a little guard duty. Seriously? Dead serious. There's a stockpile of missiles down at the shoreline that needs to be loaded on the carrier. And with all the machine activity lately, we need to stay on our toes. Of course. If you're already working on something for Yorha, I don't mind if that takes priority. Anyway, thanks in advance.
this. We've got company. Looks like machines. Alert. Jamming signals detected from enemy units. Yeah? That's not good.
Enemy machine life forms eliminated. Access point returned to functioning status. Bunker to 2B. The signal from the access point just came back online. Good job. I have some information about that, Commander. Go on. The access point went offline because machine life forms were jamming it. Which means they know that facility is one of our network terminals. Yeah, but that's not all. While they knew it was connected to our network, they didn't try to destroy it. It's almost like they were trying to lay a trap. Damn. They're getting smarter by the day. Thank you. I'll be sure to share this with the Council of Humanity on the moon. Understood.
Why must we read all these books, brother? Knowledge expands horizons and enriches existence. But can't we just transfer all this data over instantly? Into your head, perhaps, but not to your heart. <sighs> I guess. Hmm. Hey, so... Yes? My name? Eve? This book says it's a woman's name. Shouldn't we be called Cain and Abel or something instead? Humans wouldn't change names so easily. Besides, you should be proud of the name Eve. Huh. Well, if that's what you think, then I'm fine with it. Glad to hear it. Um... Is there something else? After we're done reading, can we go out and play? I'm sure it'll be tons of fun. All right, but only after we're finished. You mean it? Then I'm gonna try extra hard to finish this. Extra, extra hard! You do that. The bedrock here was bombed out in the last war. Looks like the whole city is starting to sink as a result.
Target missile sighted. Is that what we need to protect? Let's take him out already so I can be home in time for dinner and a bath. Androids don't need to bathe. As long as you perform regular cleaning and maintenance, bathing is unnecessary. Yeah, but come on, 2V. It still feels good. I think that's the last of the machines. 2B, 9S, come in. Commander? Emergency orders incoming. The carrier ship that was sent to resupply has come under attack. It's currently being engaged by a swarm of machines. I've asked all Yorha troops in the city ruins for assistance, and I'll need you to provide backup as well. I'm sending flight units and coordinates now. Good luck. You see? Total slave driver. Whoopsh. If she didn't order others around, what kind of leader would she be? Hmm. If you say so.
Attention, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. Requesting support from any friendly units in range. We've come under heavy fire from the enemy. Our escort ship has taken damage and is unable to engage. We're currently resisting with all remaining support fighters, but we can't hold them off for long. I repeat, this is Carrier Blue Ridge 2. We need immediate backup from any available Android forces. of a large-scale enemy inbound. Looks to be 2.8 clicks southwest of us. Reverting back to area recon- Wait, I'm still picking up a large enemy presence. Didn't I kill that already? What on? If it's that big, we should be able to see it. Well, that's new. <laughs> Blocking close-range attacks with EMP blasts. We've got to find another way to damage it. Operator 210 to 9S. Command has decided to stage a direct satellite laser strike on the hostel. We need you to destroy the enemy EMP generator so we can lock onto the target. EMP generator? Sending the coordinates to your map now. EMP generator target confirmed. Marking on map. Proposal. Destroy the generator quickly.
confirmed elimination of electromagnetic interference. Stand by for incoming satellite laser strike. Oh, come on! It's got an electromagnetic barrier over its whole body? Having trouble over there? Are you Yorha? Hunter Squadron deploying out of North 12C Defense HQ. I'm the Commanding Officer 4B. Don't worry, we'll take it from here. To be. Let's leave this area to the reinforcements. I have an idea. You and I should meet up at the spot I just marked. We've got mortars lining the shoreline here. All the EMP shielding in the world won't help against close-range mortar fire. Got it. I'll help aid. This armor is too thick. We need more firepower. 2B, let's try for a more direct approach. Direct? Oh, right. That's right. Lay down some fire in its stupid mouth. We gotta bail, 2B. This is bad.
Activate missile controls. Prepare to launch. Missile controls engaged. Launch ability confirmed. Fire! to control. Alert. Obstacle ahead. A collision at this speed is not recommended. Well aware, thank you. <laughs> S signal lost. Organize a search and rescue party for the missing Yorha members at once. To be. Nine S. Don't die on me. The child held sway over enormous strength. But sadly, he was also a little bit broken. He spent his long days hurting those around him. He tried his best to be good and kind. But despite his efforts, things never seemed to turn out. They told him he was unwanted. They abandoned him in the deep, dark ocean. And from the cold at the bottom of the sea, he cried out, Mother! Mother. 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 But his voice never reached his mother. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod 042, assigned to 2B. This is Tactical Support Unit Pod 153, assigned to 9S. We pods often participate in the same battles. Exchanging our situational data would theoretically allow us to plan combat strategies in a more efficient manner. Proposal. Data should be transferred regularly between Pod 042 and Pod 153. Analysis. This idea is sound. Proposal accepted. Records will be organized in time for the next situational exchange.
Each of the machines treated their treasures with great care. One treasured family above all else. Another treasured its older sibling. Another treasured its own beauty. But one more machine treasured something unique above all else. Hate. Is this... death? So dark. So cold. Ninas! Nine S. To be. Come on. Let's go home. Engage memory core diagnostics. Yeah, yeah. A single reply is sufficient for acknowledgement. Fine. Memory core diagnostics complete. No issues detected. Good. Proposal. Engage visual sensor diagnostics. You got it. Visual sensor diagnostics complete. No issues detected. All checks complete. <sighs> Took long enough. Don't you think it's overkill to perform a full data overhaul? Unit 9S was seized by the enemy and placed in a non-controlled state for an extended period of time. There is a high probability of corruption by an enemy logic virus. Alright, alright. Cram it. Anyway, I just gotta sync up with the bunker server and then I'm out of here, right? What was that? Unknown. Halt the data sync. Alert. Data synchronization is mandatory for all your high units. Yeah, I know that, but we just got some kind of weird noise. Halt the data sync for 2B as well. Affirmative. Let's figure out where that noise came from. Just to be sure, you know. Open a port to the server. No time to examine everything. Better stick to the main data nodes. Detected. Your high unit storage records. What's the point of all this heavy security? All the black box data has been deleted, but it looks like everything else is here.
Detected. Access log to Council of Humanity's lunar server. What's a barrier doing here? Hmm. Looks like records for supplies shipped to the moon. Strange. There were a ton of empty containers. That's weird. Why would they do that? Huh? A new port just opened. Detected. Council of Humanity and Project Yorho Records Index. Alert. We are not authorized to access this data. Man, this stuff is all wrong. I need to check this out too. An attack barrier? Really? Why the heck would they install one of those in this server? Let's see... It looks like info about how the Council of Humanity was formed as part of Project Yorha. Wait... Isn't that backwards? After a long period of battles and adventures, the Prophet spoke. Oh, grant me the mercy of the land. Oh, grant me the joy of the heavens. Release me from my yoke of iron. Thus shall our souls be... What was that? Crap! Did they find me? Negative. Emergency backup request from 2B. Close the server connection and activate my body. Affirmative. Ah, 9S. Operator? What happened? We recently detected large numbers of machine life forms throughout the factory area. We received a support request from 2B soon thereafter, but have been unable to respond due to poor reception. All right, I'll try to gain access from the main terminal. <laughs> 